Hello, welcome to Camo Designs, and today I'm going to show you working the foot on the 9 inch circular needles. Um, we're going to move the stitch marker to the side. So we need to knit 16, and now we're going to place a marker, and that's going to be our new beginning. And then you just knit every round until it measures 8 inches from the heel or 2 inches from the toe. Okay, and let me show you. So let me do a quick thing. So today we're going to be I'm going to show you how to work this part of the foot. So to measure it, you're going to do 8 inches from here. Then you're going to start the toe. Or you can measure 2 inches back from here. Like if you try it on, you can measure 2 inches back and that's where you stop. But Okay, so this is where we are right now. I have finished my gusset. So you can, kind of, you can see it right there. So I finished my gusset. Now I want to move this marker here. And I actually knit one just to hold it there. So I'm actually going to move this. Because I'm going to place it here where this orange one is. So I've already knit one. So I need to knit 15 more stitches. And place the new marker there. Two. Three. Four. So that's 13, so I got 14, 15, and then this would be my 16. Now I'm going to take this orange one off because that was just doing it so I could do my gusset. So this is my beginning stitch marker, so this is where I'm going to put my new marker to start my new row. Now this one I can take off, and I can take it off now because I can unhook it, but if not, if I, it was some other kind of stitch marker, I would have to wait till I got around to it to take it off. Okay, and now you just knit every round until it measures 8 inches. And I'll just show you a little bit of that, but this is going to be a quick video because it's pretty easy. So now I just did knit every round until it measures my eight inches from the heel or two inches back from the toe. Oops. There we go. So this is Red Heart Yarn. It is Super Saver Pooling. Um, and it's called papaya pooling, or some of them, the older ones just say papaya. It depends on when you bought it. Um, and I really like these colors. They're really fun. Um, I have another pattern that I did with this color called lollipop swirl, which is available on Ravelry. Um, and that is also knit. And that's it so see I just keep knitting all the way around until I get back to my beginning marker here you don't have to count every round I measure it and to measure it what you do is you lay it flat like this and you take your measuring your tape measure which mine's around here somewhere I don't know where it is right now because I have kind of chaos here so I just put my tape measure here and then I just measure until eight inches and that's it so if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and like and subscribe it doesn't cost you anything to subscribe um, and if you'd like to be notified when my next video comes out you can hit the little bell and YouTube will let you know when I have a new video up and every week I have a new knit video and then also every week I have a new left-handed crochet video. So if you're left-handed and you're interested in that, please check that out. 
We're currently working on a purse, um, a granny square purse. So if you're interested in learning to knit or you're left-handed, anything like that, check those out. And that's it. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and I will respond as soon as I can. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye.